Rahul Dravid is no longer the head coach of the Indian team. The final of the T20 World Cup was his last assignment and now we know he is not going to be continuing as the head coach of the Indian team. But as he reflects on his, uh, on his tenure as the Indian team head coach, he talks about what is it that he learnt as, uh, as a coach, as an individual. He talks about his rapport with Virat Kohli, with Rohit Sharma as well and he highlights the key part of being a head coach of any team for that matter. Let me first tell you what is it that he feels is the main job of a head coach and then we will come to what is it that he developed in terms of his rapport with Rohit Sharma and Virat Kohli. As far as being a head coach is concerned, he says that the idea should be to be on the same page with the, with the captain of the side and take the same philosophy forward. That's the main job of a head coach to be on the same page and ensure that you help the captain take the philosophy forward in terms of what is it that the captain wants his team to do going forward. So we've talked about that but let's now go forward and tell you what is it that he had to say about a certain Rohit Sharma and Virat Kohli. Starting with the first one, he says that I'm someone and this is when he talks about uh, a little more about uh, his coaching style as well and then we'll talk to you about uh, the Virat Kohli and the Rohit Sharma bit as well. He says that I'm someone who actually likes continuity and I don't like to chop and change too many things because I believe that it creates a lot of instability and doesn't create very good environment. So. Not a lot of changes is what uh, uh, Rahul Dravid believes is the way to go forward, is the way to coach a team, especially an Indian team and he's believed in continuity. That's what he feels, uh, you know, it sort of cultivates the right sort of environment as well. It cultivates the right kind of feeling as well in, within the group and that's what he gives Rohit Sharma a lot of credit for to, uh, to be able to ensure that the bunch remains close and that the bunch feels very safe uh, you know uh, uh, around each other moving forward he says that uh, i feel that i am a part of the team whose responsibility is to create the right professional safe secure environment that doesn't really have a fear of failure now the fear of failure and by the highlighted this for you as well is because this uh, this phrase has come out to haunt the Indian team several times as far as the philosophy is concerned as far as individuals are concerned as well and we we can see how despite that being a thing for the Indian team they came out of it they they did not care about the fear of failure and they went ahead and then won the T20 World Cup as well. And then lastly, he says that he's really enjoyed getting to know Rohit as a person as well. And he's enjoyed seeing his commitment and his care for his team. Exactly what I was just telling you. He then says then to adjust and try to get the right environment where everybody feels safe and secure is something that he will miss a lot. So that is as far as his rapport with Rohit Sharma is concerned. That is as far as... His understanding of Rohit Sharma, the skipper, is concerned. His time with the Indian team has come to an end, but one hopes that everything that he developed with the Virat Kohli, with the, with the Rohit Sharma, in terms of the philosophy, hopefully his successor also can have the same kind of rapport with the two Indian greats. Yes, not in the T20 format, the two will be playing, but remember, in the, in the longest format of the match, in the, uh, of, of the game, in the 50 over format of the game as well, both of them form a part of the senior leadership and one hopes that everything that they learned from, uh, from uh, Rahul Dravid, the head coach, not just stays with them, but also perhaps to the younger lot that will be now assembling alongside these guys. Hopefully, they can then go ahead and, and pass on those learnings to the youngsters as well. How do you look at the tenure of uh, Rahul Dravid as the head coach of the Indian team? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe to Sports Today.